Today on MTG Unpacked, we're heading back to 1995 and we're going to be opening a pack of Ice Age. The cards we're looking for here, the top five, pretty much Necropotence, Illusions of Grandeur, Brushland, Adaka Waste, and Sulphurous Springs. So there's not a ton of value in this set, but still we're going to be enjoying the artwork. Catching up on all the old cards that we might have missed and struggling, really struggling to open the packs. So let's see, maybe if I try the other end, I'll have better luck. There we go, so I can get that open there and hopefully don't get a peek at the cards. All right, so we're going to go three uncommons and the rare. Move that stuff to the back. And let's see what we pull today. Okay, we start off with a Mystic Remora, an enchantment for an island. Has a cumulative upkeep cost of one. Whenever target opponent successfully casts a non-creature spell, you may draw a card. That player may pay four to counter this effect. So we've got a fish there. Looks like a, what is that, a... Maybe a watercolor or acrylic. Next up, the Kjeldoran Dead. Summon Dead. 3-1 for a single swamp and my first thought on this it looked like it was a heavy metal band leave a note in the comments if you think both the name of the card and the poses of the skeletons are pretty much a band when Kildor and Dead comes into play sacrifice a creature you can pay a swamp and regenerate they shall kill those whom once they loved. Limdul the Necromancer. Interesting. Okay, Circle of Protection Green. Got some frogs. Pay one on the plains for an enchantment. And it's one to prevent all damage against you from one green source. If a source deals damage to you more than once in a turn, you may pay one each time to prevent the damage. Very straightforward. Next up we have Foul Familiar. Summon Spirit 3-1 for 3 mana. Cannot be declared as a blocking creature. Pay 1 life. Um, so if you pay a swamp, pay 1 life to return Foul Familiar to owner's hand. Effects that prevent or redirect damage cannot be used to counter this loss of life. Serve me and live forever. Limdol the Necromancer. He seems to be a popular guy. If you know what the deal is with that Limdol guy, leave a note in the comments. I'm curious what the lore is. And we've got some little weird spirit creature jumping out of that woman's head. Next up we have Lava Burst. Sorcery. 4x and a mountain. Lava Burst deals x damage to target creature or player. Effects that prevent or redirect damage cannot be used to protect that creature. Overkill. This isn't a game of kick the oof. I think we saw that oof thing before. Jaya Ballad. Task Mage. There we go. There's a bit of a Dominaria tie-in. And we've got a Volcano bursting with lava. Next up we have the Kildoran Guard. Remarkably charming fellows. Pay one and a plane, summon soldier. You can tap and the target creature gets plus one, plus one until end of turn. If that creature leaves, play this turn, bury it. Use this ability only when attack or defense is announced and only if defending player control Controls no snow-covered lands, really. So snow-covered lands are a thing. Snowfall. There we go. That is me. Here we are. Middle of April. Snow today. I think we're just about done with that. Two and an island for an enchantment. 
Cumulative upkeep cost is a island. Islands may produce an additional island when tapped for mana. This mana is usable only for cumulative upkeep. And snow covered islands may produce either an additional two islands or an additional island when tapped for mana. This mana is usable only for cumulative upkeep. So they definitely don't want you to read the card and instantly know what it's talking about. Okay. So where are we at? Three, six, seven. Chub Toad. Summon Toad. And he has just had a delicious meal. Maybe one of those uh, Kildoran guards. Pay two and a forest. You get to summon a 1-1 one, one toad. He gets plus two, plus two until end of turn when blocking or blocked. And here we have a delightful children's nursery rhyme. Chub toad, chub toad at the door. Run away quick or you'll run no more. And that's what happens. The chub toad will get you. Ray of Erasure. So you pay an island for an instant. Target player takes the top card of his or her library and puts it in his or her graveyard. Draw a card at the beginning of the next turn's upkeep. What is real can become unreal. Gerda, Age, Daughter, Archmage of the Unseen. And his skeleton is being revealed there. Not quite sure. I guess he's getting uh, vaporized. Okay, so I think this is the last of the common songs of the damned. It's an interrupt. Pay a swamp. Add a swamp to your mana pool for each creature in your graveyard. Not wind, but the breath of the dead. All right. <clears throat> so let's just check here. We're down to one, two, three. Okay, so this is this is the last common. We have Errant Tree, Enchant Creature, pay one on a mountain, target creature gets plus three plus O. Oh. If that creature attacks, no other creatures can attack this turn. That's one I can actually understand, very nice. There is no shame in solitude, the Lone Knight may succeed, we're a hundred founder. Anna Kenarud, Sky Knight, wonderful pronunciation there on my part. And a silver urn, three in an island, summon urn, has flying trample, it's a 2-2. Two -two. I've seen a larger urn knock a giant to the ground and stay airborne. They move not with the wind, but as the wind. And a Kennerid Sky Knight. So that's the first of our uncommons here. Next up we have a green scarab. Pay a planes and you get to enchant a creature. Target creature gets plus two, plus two, as long as any opponent controls any green cards. That creature cannot be blocked by green creatures. Glacial Chasm. So here's a land. Cumulative upkeep to life. When it comes into play, sacrifice the land. You cannot attack. All damage dealt to you is reduced to zero. So I was going to say, what is the benefit of that? It seems like it's not that great, but yeah, all damage dealt to you reduced to zero. That seems pretty good. And the rare is deflection. So pay three in an island for an interrupt target spell, which must have a single target. Targets a new legal target of your choice. Up and down, over and through, back around, the joke's on you. Yep, and the joke is definitely on me because Liliana did not bless the packs. And nobody said anything, although I can hear some of you in the back there yelling, He didn't bless the pack! Okay, okay. So next time, we'll remember, Liliana, you need to bless the packs. So that was Ice Age. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more Magic the Gathering unboxings and be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released and we'll be having more vintage pack openings shortly. And as always, have a great day.